Yeah, this one's on the floor, right there. Yeah. It's nice and slight. I look a two headed cotton up. See? Two heads. It's just too cotton. I think that's too smooth. Yeah. The, the heads aren't quite close enough. That makes it. Well, I don't want to get too far. Yeah. 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 All wrapped up in his water dish. Yeah. Another one underneath. That'd be half tempted for that too. back a little bit, put your head out. Take a picture. Sorry, dude. Can I say, I bet you just said someone started talking about the animals people would believe you. Yeah. It's like you wore like a button down a shirt and jeans. And you'd be like, oh yeah, you work here. Yeah, maybe that would be a little long double barrel or like something in front of you. I'll wave my hat. They get to have a nice little area. Are you guys enjoying your waterfalls? Like the birds, how they're just like, huh, huh, we could fly over you. They're not doing anything right now. None of them are hanging out in the waterfall. That's because they're all lame. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna get video though. There's the other one over there moving. Yeah. Uh, he stopped. He stopped. That guy stopped. Yeah. I'll wrestle him. Be a gator fight. <laughs> we paid ten bucks to come in here. I want to see a gator's fight. Uh, over here, but then he got to so far, he had to slow down and wait for it. Yeah. <laughs> and there, uh, another one's coming out over there. And there's one over there. Yeah, let's see. Uh, are we gonna get gator fight? Are you guys just gonna, you know, meet up and swim? Ben, you're late. <laughs> and he stopped. Yeah. Oh, uh, now the other one's coming. Apparently that one's in his way and he can't go around until you stop. Uh, that one's like turning <laughs> around. He's like, oh, big alligator coming out. This one. Yeah. Looks like you saw something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's on a mission. This alligator is on a mission right here.
Maybe someone dropped like a hat in it. Yeah. And it's like, huh. Oh, maybe I'll prove them wrong if I help them get <laughs> the kid out of the water. That alligator's on a mission. Or maybe did, did Matt, did Matt, you know, These two are just like chilling right here. Yeah, they're like, uh, they're just like, they're just gonna stay there. Oh, there's another one coming. Making a wake. Again. I wanna see a gator fight. Maybe they're friends. I like how you can see gators on this side, and then it's like a highway over there. Gators. Road. Gators. I feel like they have the nicest area. These gators right here. They have the nicest area. Uh, there's Chester. Look, you could open that door and go behind it.
Is this the one you picked out? You better say yes. <laughs> now, a moment ago, uh, Adam was out here telling you guys about the history of Cracker Style Wrestling, how it got started. You couldn't be out here mentioning oh, everything to you. Uh, one of the things you forgot to mention is just the hardest part of finding out here on the bottom is trying to catch them. I mean, look at the color on the sky. It helps them blend in really, really well with the murky water they have here in the state of Florida. He's like a charcoal, some tan yeah. colors on him. Helps them blend in really yeah. well. Another thing that helps them hide is right here at the tip of the snout. These holes, those are his nostrils. If he smells something that he doesn't like, he actually does something really awesome that we can't do with him, with ours, is that he seals them off like a valve, and he'll hold his breath and go under the water for maybe up to two hours. Now, if he smells something he does like, the next thing that's going to pop up are his eyes right here on the top of his head. Now, a lot of people in the past have asked me, aren't the eyes in a bad spot? Because what happens if they swim across like a low-lying branch and maybe a prey item tries to claw up their eyes? Well, I'll show you guys that's not the case. The eyes are actually very well protected. I'll show you guys over here first. For 10 to 1 second, my two fingers are like low-lying branches or maybe like prey and like claw trying to poke out his eyes. The danger comes across the eyes. The eyes go right inside the head. The danger comes right back up. The headlights on the floor back. <laughs> Two guys over here, they go whoop, right down the head and the pop right back up. Two guys over here, they go whoop, right down the head and the pop right back up. <laughs> there we go. So two guys over here, they go whoop, right down the head and the pop right back up. You can do one eye, both eyes, go backwards on. Make sure you take one finger and just jam it down in there. And it doesn't bother at all. Kids, fight on each other. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> Now look on everyone's faces, you know, you're just to see me sit on this thing and poke it in the eye. You want to see some crazy stuff, right? Yeah! Five of you. You want to see some crazy stuff, right? Yeah! Alright, now before we get to anything too dumb, I'm going to ask you a question, you just shout it out once you know the answer. What's the most dangerous part of an alligator? Tail! Tail! Alright, I think I'm hearing two different answers, so we'll put through a boat. Okay, we'll put through a boat. If you think it's the mouth, raise your hands. Okay, if you think it's a tail, raise your hands. Okay, everyone for tail, keep your hands up. Take a really good look at me right now. <laughs> Hold on to the foot in the front. It's the mouth, guys, it's the mouth. Come on. When's the last time you turned on the news and it said, man, we did that by Alger's tail in court? It doesn't happen, okay? It comes next to the mouth open. I'm going to try to show you guys inside this alligator's mouth. I do stress the word try because now you can count alligators have one of the strongest bites in the animal kingdom. But he doesn't want his mouth open. There's really not a whole lot I can do about it. So we'll get ready for a quick look.